this is the most serious episode of dummy commentaries that I'll ever make. And that's saying a lot because this is usually for fun. Alright, but I'm not, I'm, I don't think I'm playing around when I'm doing this. So, let's begin, shall we? Eddie the Scammer, remember when you requested that I do a rant on you? Uh, yeah. A joke rant, actually, but you decided to make it serious. And I didn't stop you. Looking back on your early days and your Conswagon Eddie cartoon, I'm now regretting ever being a fan of yours. The cartoon that inspired you to animate. The one that you constantly cited as being your inspiration for animating. Makes you hate me now. Or just regret being a fan of me. Okay, seems legit. Eddie, you have stirred up a lot of drama not only with the commentary community, but you've also burned bridges with Guri Gorilo X. Now, Guri Gorilo X, maybe so. Alright, Berg. Maybe so. That's a big maybe because I don't talk to him. I don't know what he thinks of me, but I'll have to reserve judgment on that. Mr. Conman123? Now, that's a big no, Berg, and I'm going to tell you why. If he was fed up with me at all, alright, he would stop talking to me. Alright, just period. Stop talking to me on Google Hangouts or whatever. Alright, he would just never talk to me again. Alright. But, he still does. He still talks to me. In fact, we had a chat last night with Billy and Cheesy. So, yeah, no. We're still friends. Started crap with my uncle for no good reason. Now, believe it or not, Berg, that wasn't me starting crap with him. That was me continuing crap with him because three months ago, he and I started this thing where if I'd find a comment made by him, I'd just smack talk him and we'd just smack talk each other. Or if he found a comment made by me, we'd smack talk each other. I, I consider it as like lighthearted, fun little flame wars. I don't know how he considers it, but... I just think they're just like st stupid little fun flame wars. Because for every time I mocked him for being a brony, he'd mock me for being an Ed Ed and Eddie fan. It's that simple. And even made a baseless rant on me considering that I've been more than willing to give you advice. I have nothing to argue with here, but I will give you this, Berg. That rant was terrible, alright? It was poorly researched, and I just didn't do a good job on it. Okay, I'll agree with you on that. At least I'll give credit where credit is due. Instead of making excuses like you are having personal problems just to garner sympathy. I don't think you'd be saying that right now if you actually knew what was going on in my personal life, Berg. Because I don't hide my mistakes. I don't cover them up with, oh, I'm autistic, okay? Alright, because... If something in real life is pissing me off to the point where I take it out on YouTube, I am going to say it. I don't bullshit for sympathy. Yes, I should bring more variety to my channel, but you are one to talk, Eddie, considering that you did baseless rants and didn't even care to collaborate with the people that were fans of Conswag and Eddie. Well, for one, those baseless rants were from two years ago. Do I continue rants anymore? Also, I never collaborated with anyone who liked Conswag and Eddie. Alright, let me just list off the bat the people that I got to do voices for episodes. The Fiery Henry, Cheese Ninja, Coolio Swag, Luigi2600, Sean Sampson, TJ Asta, Ryan, and of course Billy Willie. In fact, Billy Willie helped me write the backstory for his character, so I don't know where you're going at with freaking, oh, I don't want to collaborate with anyone who liked Conswag and Eddie. I don't know where you're going with that. Look, if people like my rants, of course people would like to see more rants. And to me, that makes a lot of sense. In fact, I go by that principle. For example, if people wanted to see more episodes of the Eddie and Cheesy show, of course I'm going to still make episodes of the Eddie and Cheesy show. Also, no, the Eddie and Cheesy show is not cancelled. If it was, I would have publicly announced it, which I haven't. Just because you hate rants don't mean I should stop ranting just to entertain you. Ah, uh, don't be ridiculous. Even when I was causing drama on the comments of your videos, I never said at all that you should stop 
making rants. Nowhere in my rants on you have I ever told you to stop making rants. In fact, in that same video, I said, I know that you could make good rants. And then you have the temerity to tell me not to rant on people that are commentators. Now, if you want to rant on commentators, you have every right to. I'm obviously not going to stop you from doing that. But, never did I once tell you to stop ranting on commentators. I told you to rant on different things. And heck, I didn't even know why you were doing those when I made the crappy video. Alright, until you told me. If you can't respect what I've done to help the commentary community get a little better, then why are you subscribed to me? Okay, let me say it again. Even if I'm not a fan of the rants you did on the commentators, I, deep down inside, know that you could make good rants. Heck, your rant on vegans was good. I'm not gonna lie. That is why I still like your content, Berg. So yes, Eddie. This is my warning to you. Either you stop causing drama, or I'm going to block you. If you really think I'm causing such a problem, block me if you must. I'm obviously not going to stop you. But, in all due respect, it is it has just been accepted by me, and expected by me, that I'm in the future I might cause drama once again. Because I am such a douchebag. Now you might be wondering why I made this video, Berg. Well, it's not to attack you because, again, I'll give credit where credit is due. But, there were some things in this video that either were not true about me, or just things that I could just prove wrong, like what you said about Con Man burning his bridges with me. Now, this will be a very controversial video, most likely, because everyone wants my head on a goddamn spike at the moment. But at least I didn't come off as a douchebag in this video, alright? At least give me that much.